In this step, we're going to configure and enable our energy meters within the system. We have two meters, the production meter and the consumption meter. We'll start with the production meter. We'll tap on the production meter, which then gives us an immediate reading of the power that's being generated from PV. It says it's about 2.8 kilowatts. The instruction is to make sure that the PV circuit is switched on and has been running for at least five minutes. I'll confirm that's the case and tap next. Now it asks to switch off PV breakers, which I'll do. As we turn off PV, what we would expect is that the generation would drop to zero, which it has. That's verifying that the system is working as it should. So we'll enable the production meter.